YouTube, what's poppin'? It's me, Streamers Playbook. I appreciate you all who have come by, who have subscribed, who are liking my videos. I'm having a blast streaming and doing YouTube, and so it's all to you guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. And if you're interested in streaming, and I, I'm coming out with two videos a week, how-tos, tips, tricks, all kinds of things, so hit the subscribe button if you're trying to learn more streaming tips, tricks, and how-tos. Go ahead. And if this video is helpful to you, please click the like button, okay? I really appreciate it. Hitting those likes really helps push your video out there as a YouTube, as a YouTuber, okay? So today I'm coming at you with a fantastic, magnificent, beautiful uh, video on how to suggest streamers on Twitch. So this is a great way to network, and I'll touch about, I'll talk about how, why it's a good reason to network, or why it's a good way to network at the end of this video. So make sure to stick around. So first things first, let me show you how to suggest streamers on Twitch. It's super easy. So if you've probably seen before, if you go to someone's channel, so right now I'm on my channel, if you go to the homepage and you scroll down, see here it says streamers playbook suggest these streamers. You got Tim the Tap Man, you know, swag, bonsai bro, okay? So one way to do it, if you're already suggesting streamers, you wanna change who you're suggesting, you would just click the edit streamers button. But if you're not already suggesting streamers, you have to set that up. In order to do that, you would go over here, click on this icon in the top right, and go down to your settings button, okay? Settings, I'm gonna go ahead and click it. And then now, you're gonna go over to the channels and channel and videos tab, okay, right here. So go ahead and click that. Now we're gonna scroll all the way to the bottom, and then you should have this, it should say my streamer shell, all right? And so this is where you're gonna change your suggested streamer. So if I go ahead and click this edit button, you'll see I have, these are the list of streamers that I'm suggesting. So if I wanted to get rid of someone, you just hover over it and you would click this uh, trash can button, okay? So like that. Now, if I wanna search for channels to host, you just click that, unless I wanna host uh, Cypher PK, right? Oh, so let me make sure that save, it did. Okay, so you just, you have your suggested streamers and you wanna make sure that this tab is marked to auto host list, all right? So team members, that's for if you're a Twitch partner, you can create a team and add members to your team that is how you would choose that if you want to suggest members from your team, okay? And if you don't want to suggest any streamers, which is what I usually typically do, you would just click that none button. And that little tab at the button I showed you at the bottom where it had all those suggested streamers, it won't appear on your channel. But I'm going ahead and I'm going to click this button. Those are the streamers I put. Now you click save, it's going to save. And now when I go back, let me show you, it is, if I go back to my channel and I scroll down, go to the home screen again, I scroll down, look at Streamers Playbook suggested streamers. We have Cypher, PK, Swag, Bonsai Bros, Eagle okay. All those people. So that's how you would add your streamers. And then if I wanna change, this is just a quick way to do it. You would just go over here, edit suggested streamers, okay? Now I would change it. Now it's not gonna auto host, let me tell you. I know it says auto host list, but if you wanna change that, you would turn it on here. So now it will auto host. So once I go offline, it's gonna auto host someone from my list. And then if that's selected, I can go down and I can choose to host channels by the order they appear on my list. So let's say it's, first I want Tim the Tap Man. If he's not on, I want Cypher PK. If he's not on, I want, you know, uh, whoever. I want Valky Ray or whoever. She's not on Twitch anymore, but you get the idea. Or you could just choose it from uh, random, okay? So that's how you would change that, but I'm gonna turn this off. So if you don't wanna have it automatically auto-host, you just turn that off. If I click save, I'm gonna close this for now. And now I'm gonna go to uh, channel. Go ahead and click channel and then Yes, so I'm gonna now tell you why this is such a cool feature, this suggested streamers thing. So it's a great way to network because if you have a group of friends that you stream with or you've met people on Twitch, it doesn't hurt to just say, hey, it's like a billboard. Could you put me as your suggested streamer? I'll put you out there, okay? So now anytime someone comes to your homepage, they're gonna say, oh, you know, this part, I like this streamer and they suggest swag or they suggest bonsai bros or whoever. I like that, I'm gonna check these people out. I've seen that a lot of times people who do like similar games. So let's say you do Warzone. If you're like, hey, if you like Warzone, you also like these streamers. Or if you do whatever, League of Legends or a game, or maybe you're into some kind of, uh, you're like an Ask Me Anything streamer or uh, you know something like that. You would also like these streamers. So it's a good way to kind of work together as a community. If this was helpful, like the video and please subscribe. If you want more tips and tricks about streaming, hit the subscribe button. Again, I appreciate you all. And have a wonderful, fantastic Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, every day. Fantastic. Okay. You guys are awesome. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.